What's up guys? Welcome back. So, today, we're going to be doing, seeing how long it takes this coach, as you can see is alright handling, it's pretty fast, not got a throw ties on. It's just an average off-roader, let's give it that. The best in the game, it's not the worst. So, we're just going to be racing this against a chopper. We're not expecting this to win, but we've just seen how much longer it will take in this. And is it really worth driving that extra mile to get the chopper? So, as you can see, it's an okay off-roader. It's really not got a whole lot of grip, but it's got an okay amount. It does fly around a bit, but not as much as some of the other off-roaders. Like, I've done this a lot quicker in a Camacho, but as with fully off-road tires, not fully, like, you know, it's just fully upgraded and all that, and meant for off-road but this is just more like your average off-road on so right start the timer um, so it's got grip but it's not got power if it had more power then oh very big up there but just fly around a bit still but you can't blame it for that i'm just trying to get it to fall down the mountain so, just driving up here. Actually, this is quite fast, and this is one of the fastest routes I found before I made this video. So, I, have, I was having a little look around on that. So, I was simply just trying to see which one was the best. So, hop. Keep it family friendly. Don't hit any people. Go through the shrubs. I feel like I'm going to fall off and die or something, huh? You mess up under control like a pro. As you know, I'm not the best driver. I'm not all the I'm not the worst. Mm, oh no! Losing my time. Come on. It's the timer at you tell me. On. Oh, please don't fall off! Oh, dear. Cool, a Frodo. Let's go, let's go, let's go! And I'm at the top now! So, that was 1 minute 50. Let's go back down. And here we are guys, going back down. Also, I'd like to mention, for the making of this video, I have a new editor. He's not paid, he's not really known, he doesn't want any attention, and I messed that up a lot. So, everybody, I'm not going to give a link to his channel, I'm not going to tell you who he is, I'm not going to... But, please, um... Say what you think of his editing and whether I should continue it. This calm, calm moment in time. Think about it. Oh, you can tell it's GTA because you'd definitely be dead five times over in real life. So, I don't know what GTA have done there. I know they're trying to keep it like game map, but Story Mode would have died, to be honest. I'm just trying to damage it as much as possible, but still, no, nope, never mind. When it came off, it ain't too serious. All right, guys, I'm in the same position in the chopper and start the timer. But I'm just seeing if it's really worth driving that extra mile to get the chopper to get to the top. And I'm pretty sure it is almost exactly a mile. You test that. And for yourself. As far as I know, I'm going the shortest route. As you know, I've got my radar on again. So. All good. As I also like to add, that this would be quite a short video if I didn't do the job, because this was never the plan. Don't lie. So, um, 
hope this comes to the intent moment. And here we are in Scott Butch wheels on the ground. Alright, that is one minute and eight seconds, I do believe. Tell me if I'm wrong, but well, there we are. It's 42 seconds slower than the car, but it it would probably take that long just to drive to a nearest airfield or whatever. As you know, this isn't the fastest chopper. It's also not <laughs> nowhere near the slowest, so. You know, there's nothing wrong with it. I'm just gonna might just hop down the mountain in a second. As you can see, I had my cargo bob here in case anything went wrong. Thinking about doing it in this, but it would just take years. Probably way quicker in the car. So yeah, I'm just gonna hop down here. Um, as we're getting close to the end of the video for a little while, but still. Oh, I thought you could... never mind. James Bond up. It really is quite high. It is in cliffs. It's really unbelievable how people still play this game. I know not many people play this game, but... After how many years? Like seven years or something? People still play this game. It's still updated and that. I don't think it's going to be updated anymore, but I know they still do patch glitches and that. Less than they did, but still do it. You want GTA 6? So, thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. Um, tell me what you think of the intro. And I'll see you in the next video.